Shundi. You'd better not make a habit of fighting the elderly, because you never know when you might bump into Shundi. His iconic drunken kung fu may look clumsy and comical, but it's actually a sneaky means of introducing a character with a meter into the Virtual Fighter series. As the drinks counter in the corner goes up, and his face gets redder, Shundi's kung fu gets more and more deadly. With each drink, his damage output steadily increases, and he adds more and more moves to his already massive command list. To make matters worse, some of the moves unlocked include their own drink and animations too, so if you fail to contain Shun early on, he can become quite the unstoppable force as his drinks lead to more and more opportunities to drink again. With that in mind, the game plan is simple here. Get drunk and get the party started. At 4 drinks he gains access to his backhand, Swiss and Gyoin, a hit confirmable half circular that covers a good range allowing Shun to take more advantage of his evasive movement and strike from a distance. It can also now string onto the back of his punch string, Renkan Gyoinshu. At 6 drinks, he unlocks Rengeki Kokashitai, which when paired up with the aforementioned Renkan Gyoinshu, puts the defender in a high-low guessing game due to the rapidly deploying low kick. And at 10 drinks, Shun is the life of the party, with access to a potent throw game made possible by the new threat of his Gohai Senbu, a high damage throw that gives Shun an additional 4 drinks every time it lands, causing Shun to grow exponentially in power. Up until this point, his best throws, which are still very strong and threatening, mostly require throw breaks in the opposite direction to the Gohai Senbu, so if the opponent isn't playing bartender throughout the match, the effects here can be quite sobering. Of course, this dependency on his bottle also makes some of the setups quite predictable and controllable. An opponent with a game plan geared towards denying Shun any drinking room, and an awareness of the right combos to sober him up, can really leave him high and dry. There's a lot on the shelf with Shun, not just in drink locked moves, but also a gigantic move list divided across several stances. But find the right mix and get through his hangovers and you can create one hell of a destructive cocktail. Thank you very much for watching and to our patrons for supporting us. Next up is the heavy hitting Yokozuna, Taka Arashi.